world are a bunch of secret vehicles that belong to me. From helicopters to planes to supercars that we've never seen before. And it all started with this beauty. My very first classic car in GTA 5. It's got the logo, it's got the channel color. I'm gonna miss this beast, but it ain't going anywhere. Because I'm gonna find my very first vehicle using this. It's about time we get our very first collection of cars. I've been waiting for this day to come forever. I'll be able to live the dream exactly how I wanted to. In my luxury jet, flying high in the sky. Oh my days, yeah, it's on the road. <laughs> Let's get the first ride. I had this car built the other day, and I gave it to the mechanic to look after. It is officially the brand new North car. <laughs> yeah. I need to come up with a name for this. It's got six wheels. It's got a logo. Bro, this is literally the car of my dreams. Anyway, I got this huge glass window. It's electric and there's not much inside here because you don't need too much. But let me just show you how fast this goes. It is such a beauty. <laughs> and yes, you are thinking right. It's got a rocket engine. <laughs> we can go so fast in this. It's quiet, it handles pretty well, and it's basically a tank. If I crash into anything, they're going either around me or straight over me. Unless I crash into pillars like that. Maybe we better keep our eyes forward and not backwards. You probably know enough about this vehicle. I collected the other day. And if you don't, if you're not subscribed, then what are you playing at? You better subscribe now. Help us get to 7 million. And I heard a rumor that if you press that button, something weird happens to you. Does something weird happen? Ah, oh, you'll have to let me know in the comments. Hey, wait, I think something weird did happen. What's happened to my voice? Oh my days! You guys have got to press like to get it back to normal. You are even mind. You guys got to press like now. You got to do it. I Oh, thank you so much. Jeez. Anyway, I've collected the two vehicles, which I know about. The rest of them I have no idea about. So, are you ready to see what they're about? Let's go and take a look. I traveled a long way for this, and I can finally see it. And I think somebody's standing next to my car, too. How dare they? No one's allowed to look at my car before me. Hey, mister, I don't know what your name is, don't know what you're doing, but get away from my car. I got it modified just for me. <laughs> Whoa, this is actually really sick. Yo, look at the tires. Bro, they're like all different. The front one's different. That one's different. That's different. Yo, I love the front one. And why does it say ASAP on the number plate? Surely it should say like North or something. I will come around to there another time. I love how my logo is all over this thing. This is a really nice car. I really like it. It's got golden trimmings everywhere. And yo, look at the back window. That's nice. Oh, the smoke coming from the exhaust, too. This feels like an actual rally car. Whoa, my date's at it. Yep, it definitely is. Did you see the skidding I did? <laughs> I barely even accelerated. All right, so th this is really good at drifting. All I gotta do is wobble, and this car is like skidding everywhere straight into a lamppost. Amazing. <laughs> We're gonna have so much fun driving this. Can you imagine taking this down a ramp or something crazy like that? Because I can! Oh, you guys are the luckiest people in the world. Hey, what's the speaker system like? Oh, yeah. Oh, you guys gonna have to speak up soon because I won't be able to hear a thing. Okay, for real, I actually want to see how fast this can go because I reckon this car can get to quite a high speed. And look at me go. We're already racing. We're picking up some speed now. Oh, my days. We're going to be capping out pretty soon. We're still going faster. Are you out of your mind? How are we still going faster? The speedometer is 220. Bro, it's... Oh, my days. I'm pretty sure that, like, skimmed 240. And my car is okay. This is a beast. I love this. <laughs> Who needs futuristic-looking cars? Who needs six-wheeler rocket cars when you've got this machine? Anyway, this needs to go exactly where it belongs. That's right. In my garage. I don't even know how many vehicles we're gonna collect, so maybe we should like focus on storing them instead of leaving them right in the center. Alright, I'm gonna store this one right here. This is, this is like a dream come true. You know, having one car is enough. Having two is even better, but having an entire collection of vehicles is just insane. Oh, and before we get to the next one, I haven't even shown you this yet, but I got a yacht as well. I, I, I got that before the video in case you were wondering. But there it is in all its glory. I'll get on the yacht later. We got some pretty cool things on board. But right now, I'm on a time limit because at the end of the day, these vehicles might disappear. Or billionaires like Devin might take them. Are you kidding me? Come on. I don't really want to be that person, but I'm seeing a lot of guards in his driveway. Like, I've counted at least 10 and I've only just walked over. Let me see if I can see any more on this. One, two, three, 
four, five. Oh my days. They're literally everywhere. There's a whole meeting happening over there. Are you crazy? All right, here's the deal. If I go in guns blazing, I'm probably gonna die. But you guys can give me an army by pressing that subscribe button. So if you haven't subscribed yet, I really recommend you do. So you can join the game and come and help me out. I really want that car after all. Oh, yay. Wait, someone actually subscribed. Are we gonna get anyone else? Because uh, I don't really want to go in there just me and this dude. I mean, I know we're good at this game, but yo, he's gonna die within two seconds. Oh, here we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, thank you so much, guys. We are building up quite the group, and we are... Okay, right? It, it's not building up anymore. All right, fellas, listen to me. You are part of the best channel in the universe. You are valued. You are incredible. You're a subscriber of note. That's something. And you managed to do it before 10 million. That's something else as well. So how about this? We storm that house, take down everyone inside, and drive away with our car. What belongs to us? <laughs> yeah, I no one's gonna cheer. Ah, oh, there we go. Now we got a bit of a cheer. All right, fantastic. Let's do this. <laughs> I'll make that first shot. You guys stay close behind me. There we go. Oh, my days. They're shooting me. They're getting me. Come on, fellas. Help me out. <laughs> this is awesome. I think I might just let them get involved. So we got my entire army flooding in. You guys are legends. You're doing a fantastic job. Someone has made the push all the way to the gate. You guys are breaking in now. This is awesome. Let's go. Let's go. We're taking that car. Take him down. Look at this. They're swarming the place. They've already taken out the group of men having the meeting and the ones on the roof. Fellas, I'm proud of you. You've done a really good job. We've cleaned out the house. I don't think there's any survivors left. <laughs> This is insane. Oh, my days. And there's my car. What a beast. Hey, who shot the window? Come on. You are meant to keep this ride intact. I really like the design. Like, have you seen the exhaust pipes? They're huge. Let's jump inside. Is this some sort of, like, hot rod or something? It's got the Ford logo on the back and my logo. Ford Tudor Hot Rod 1930 Muscle Edition. This car, believe it or not, is almost 100 years old. I am driving an artifact right here. All right, he wants to come with me. Hey, here we go. We got a friend. Come on, get in, buddy. I don't know where you're going to sit. Is there room? Ah, yeah, there's room. All right, me and my twin, we're getting out of here. Thanks, fellas. You've done great. So this is a proper classic. I actually can't believe I own one of these. Oh, my days. Yo, yo, yo. Chill. This car is a liability. It almost flipped. All I did was go around a corner. I can tell this is from the 1930s. This is wobblier than me when I get up in the morning. Jeez. <laughs> all right, let me just... Oh, boy. All right, the handling's pretty bad. But overall, it's still... It drives. That's... Oh, my days. I flipped it. But I flipped it. Oh, I didn't even flip it over. <laughs> this is going to get me killed at some point. But I really like the car. Look at the engine. The engine's animated. The flaps come open. That's awesome. And I've already off the road again. Oh my days. I, I kid you not, I am trying. It's just this car is not like the other ones. But I flipped it again for the second time. I am the worst driver in the world. Did I even get a license for this game? I don't think I did. Oh, I, oh my days. Someone's cycling past me. Are you out of your mind? I forgot to mention the even crazier vehicle. I have my own blimp in case you didn't realize it's right there. Oh my days. How have I done that? How have we actually done that, dude? Yes, subscribe, please, so you can watch more incredible driving like this. Just get it in the house. The brakes aren't even that good either. Like, I'll be going at 10 mile an hour, I brake. That's at least a three meter stop. It's basically a roll stop. So I'm just gonna park this in the corner right over here. Perfect, there it is. Okay, twin, I want you to guard my vehicles with your life. And, are you, are you, are you stuck? Okay, fantastic. You can't leave. Guard my vehicles with your life. I'm gonna go and get some more. What on earth am I gonna find here? This is the Los Santos Naval Warehouse. This is where they build, like, submarines and boats. Oh, yo, could you imagine if I have a boat? Or even better, a submarine. Can you imagine? By the way... Love what you've done with the security box. Got the channel logos on there. Oh, my days. You have done a fantastic job. <laughs> it might be underwater. We never know. We'll, we'll find out in a second. What about over here? That's empty as well. Is it underwater? Let me just take a little look. Nothing's underwater here. I can see the end. What about down here? Is there anything underwater here? Uh, no. All right. This is empty as well. Unless it, it could be out there, maybe. Let's take a look. Okay. There's nothing out here either. This is so confusing. What do they expect me to find? Hold up just a second. You guys see that? Hello, 
looks like a very bright blue. Almost as bright as our channel and my t-shirt. Right, let me find a ladder. I think that could be our next ride. What is that? Are you kidding me? Bro, this is like the tiniest car ever. Let's just see what this is about. Maybe it could redeem itself. Wait a minute. Oh, no, guys. It's a three-wheeler. It's a pigeon. I've had this car a few times. Never for me. Someone has customized this and put my name on it. It's just like written by hand. The worst way possible. Is it what I was expecting today? No, but at least I got a, a, a cooler in the back. I can keep my lunch in there. I don't know how much lunch I'm gonna be eating, but there's plenty of room. There's my light. I can drive like I own the place. Oh my days. This I can't tell if I'm gonna be embarrassed or not. I think I'm gonna be embarrassed, but this is still a really cool ride. I mean, I would love to drive this in GTA Online. Imagine the, oh my days. This one can't even stay on his wheels either. I take that back. Driving this in online is a liability. It really is. Anyway, how do I get out of this building? The gates were locked. I need to find like another way to leave. Can I go through this door? Oh, whoa, I actually can. <laughs> I wasn't expecting to go through that. You know what sucks? Is that it doesn't even have like a, a, a siren. You know, it's got a horn, but no siren. It's just got these lights. So you just gotta hope people see the lights. If they don't, then they're gonna ignore you. Oh, hang on, these guys aren't ignoring me. Yo, what do you think of my new ride? Do you like it? I think it's pretty cool. See, it's even got a horn. Okay, you get back to your conversation. No one cares, come on. Hey, wait, hold up. You guys see that? There's like custom things around this world for me. Check it out. That's my logo. Oh, this is an awesome construction yard. I want to come back here. There's even more decks and panels. Are they building something for me over here? Because I'm really into that. I love this. Yeah, keep building. Anyway, I, I just want to see if this can actually... Oh, yo, it can. It can make people stop. Watch this. All right, I'm going to drive normally. Look at that silver car in front of me. I might be a utility vehicle. I might look boring. But the moment I put that light on, they've seen it. They pulled over. Yeah, that's right. You better pull over. Get out of my way. Switch it off. Sneak up behind this guy. Is he paying attention? Is he gonna get a parking ticket? Oh, he's paying attention as well. Don't just stop in the road, though. That's so dangerous. <laughs> yeah. All right, I take it back. I really like this ride. And it's a one-seater, so it's either me driving it or nobody else. You are gonna go right next to the hot rod. This is kind of confusing. I totally forgot about my twin. Thanks for guarding anyway. You've done an amazing job. Let's get the next one. Which is at the airport. Let's make a guess on what we're gonna find. Oh, yeah. This is my kind of place. I love the airport. I'm getting a bunch of signs that they don't want in my video. I don't know, guys. Something about the panels and the rubble, the boxes being under my colors, too, and uh, no one stopping me getting inside. This is awesome. Now, since I'm going to the airport, I think the next vehicle is gonna be a plane. I don't know. I'm just making a guess. I'm gonna take a look around the back of the hangars and then across the runway. I'll be amazed if it wasn't a plane, but it's pretty clear around here. That's a 747. That definitely isn't mine. Doesn't look anything like the channel. So to my plane B. It's empty around there. What about in this hangar? Come on, come on, come on. It's not in there either. Where is it? What about down there? Are you serious? This is where you keep all your private vehicles. Come on. Why it's not in this hangar is a mystery. I can't believe there's limousines and not my aircraft. What is it they want me to find? And where do they want me to find it? Hold on. You guys see that? There's a there bright blue on the right over there. I've kept it suspenseful for me, but if I go around this corner, my plane might be there. That's it. That's beautiful. That's so cool. You've even given me a blue... Oh, jeez. I am the worst driver in the world. You've given me a blue propeller. This is so weird. Okay, you know what? Jump in. I, I don't want to believe this works, but I think it does. Jump in. The door comes out. There's my logo as well. It's the Cirrus Aircraft SR-22. Nothing's happening. It's not... It's not working. Why won't you work for me? What do we have to switch to get this thing on? There's got to be something. Oh, wait. We got it. We got it. We got it. The propellers are moving. Now they look black. I'm pretty sure they were blue a second ago, but yeah, we'll ignore that for now. Let's get this thing out of the airport. I got my own plane. How crazy is this? Thank you to whoever made this plane for me. I love it so much. It's incredible. And I've already taken off. Let's bring those wheels up. Okay, the wheels don't go up. That's cool. We don't need the wheels to go up anyway. All I need to do is fly this back to my house. That's literally all we're going to do. Look at the cinematic. I can do, can I do a little like barrel roll? This is probably not recommended. But I did anyway. Can we go the other way? Oh, yeah. Check it out. Oh, my days. I am so going to crash at this point. 
<laughs> this is so risky, but I got my plane. Wait, hold on. Is this a four-seater? Yo, I think it's a six-seater. One, two, three, four. And then if you look at here, you could squash someone in the back. This is a five-seater plane. That's a single seat in the back. This is awesome. This is amazing. Make sure you pay close attention because at the end of this, I need you to vote which vehicle is your favorite. And the most favorite one might just come back for another video. Anyway, here's my house. It's the most colorful thing in this universe. You honestly can't miss it. Okay, this, this is tricky. How am I gonna... Oh, that is. Watch out for the blimp. Watch out for that thing. How do I land this? Right, you know what? I got a plan. I'm gonna land on the road. This is flawless. This is... Oh, yeah, check it out. Didn't even destroy the plane. Let's go. The only thing left to do is to drive this into my garage. Hey, you guys are going to have to hold up for a second. I'm just trying to get this in my house. Um, is this even going to work? Yeah, this ain't going to work. The wings are too wide. Come on. Because I'm an absolute professional, I totally got this on the roof myself. I did not use mods to get up here. But that's irrelevant. I got it on the roof. Let's get the next vehicle. Wait a minute. Do I know this house? I'm pretty sure I remember it from like three years ago. I threw a Christmas party here and it's my old house. I never thought I would see this place again. Wait a minute, what are they doing? Are they drilling it up? Are you crazy? Hold on, someone bought my old house. No, 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 we're not doing that. No, 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 no one's, no one is, is buying this house. It's mine. I haven't seen this place in like three years. I don't care if it's got the old logo. We can get a new logo on that. And oh my days, is that my car? It hasn't got any like logos on it or anything, but I'm taking it. Maybe the new owner took the logos off and claimed it as our own. What is this? The Firebird One. Hold up, this is crazy. This is the craziest car ever. <laughs> it's a plane car. Whoa. Wait, does it have an engine? got a rocket engine. It, this, this is insane. Okay, I'm gonna save the house tour for another time. I honestly, I can't face going in there again. It's a beautiful house. Dig it up on the channel if you want to find the video. It's there, trust me. It's like years old, but it's there. It's an amazing house, don't get me wrong, but this car looks even better. And I've never driven something like this before. Does it like fly? Come on. Come on. Why do you have wings if you don't fly? How do we get you to fly, huh? Da, da, da. Oh, man, I don't think it flies. That's cool. It doesn't need to fly anyway. It's got wings. I'm going to jump up the hill and see how we do. Yeet! Jeez. Maybe not that hill. That was dangerous. This is a contender for being my favorite car. It's not every day you get to drive a car that looks like a flying rocket on the streets. Anyway, we are about to see what this can do because I am jumping over one of these hills straight across to my house. We're taking a bit of a shortcut. This looks like it could be the top and I'm pretty sure my house is down. Where is it? Where is it? I want to make sure I'm lined up properly. There's the blimp, which means there's my house. All right, this is gonna be so fun. You reckon I can fly to my house in the Firebird one? Oh, buddy, your head's out the window. Just, just wanted to let you know. In case you're wondering. Oh my days, this is so disorientating. Oh, why is it got the Lamborghini logo on the steering wheel? You know what? I'll just call it for what it is. That's so cool. Three, two, one. Firebird one has blast off. Let's go. <laughs> This is amazing! And we're coming down to land. Okay, that well, that was amazing for a second, but you know what? It's cool. I'm still falling, and we're still going towards my house. And most of all, I'm still alive. Let's do this again. Yeet, let's go! <laughs> what do I rate this car out of 10? It's an 11 for me. This is the best car ever. It might not be blue. It might not have the logo on it. I'm pretty sure that person, whoever she was, took the logo off it and made it this boring color. Don't know why she would do that. It would have been so much cooler if I had my branding on it. Anyway, let's just get the next one because we're like seven vehicles in and I know there's more out there. And after a very long train ride, I'm finally here. Polizzo Bay. Welcome back. It's been a while because in that barn is my next vehicle. This could be anything. It could be from like a tractor to a car to even a bike to literally anything. I don't really know what it could be, but we're about to find out in Sankuto Grain Growers Cooperative. American Growers, San Andreas County. All right, let's go. <laughs> I want to see what you got in there. Oh my days. Hold on just a second. You, you parked this in a barn full of cows. Yo, can you can you step away from my rad, please? I would hate for you to get some cow pat on it or, you know, something. There we go. Thank you. You just, you do you. Oh, my days. You stink. Mm -hmm. All right, let me just take a look at this. 
because this is my brand new ride. It looks like the most expensive one I have ever seen. It's a Bugatti. That's probably why. That would definitely be why. It's got the Bugatti logos. I'm pretty sure this is Bugatti Belide. Let's jump in. Yo, can you guys step away from my car? You're gonna get a little dirty and muck it up and everything. Bugatti Belide Super. Have I really got this? Is this really mine? I've officially got like the most expensive car in the universe. Out of all the vehicles, I didn't think I would get this one. Yeah, he agrees as well. He's nodding his head. I totally agree. All right, let's get out of here. It sounds like a beast. It drives like a beast. And I'm only in gear four. Can you believe that I'm doing 113 mile an hour? We're only in gear four. I don't know what we need to do to get maximum speed, but <laughs> I'll take it. We're going to be back at our house in no time. Unless we crash pull down a cliff and sink this to the bottom of the ocean, which is extremely possible. But I recovered it. That was close. Am I gonna have to stop parking them in the middle of the driveway? Like, I'm pretty sure I'm done for garage space now. Ah, uh, we got one more place next to the rocket car. Yeah, I think we can squeeze this one in. All right, let's get the next one. I can't believe I got a Bugatti Belide. That's like a $20 million car. Hillbox Hill Medical Center. Why am I here? Listen, I found cars in weird places, but this, this is the strangest. Who owns this car and why is it at the hospital? Well, it's, it's not down there, so maybe it's around the front. What are we gonna find? Is it like a skateboard or something? Ow, ow. It could be a skateboard, to be honest. Just don't jump into dustbins. I would like to be conscious when we find this right. And not in a hospital bed looking at it to my right. Wait, 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 hang on a second. Hold on, is that mine? That's my banner. What about on the other side? That's my logo. It's got the same color as my t-shirt. This is amazing if I want to do camouflage hide and seek. But they got my entire banner on the truck. That is so crazy. How have you done this? All right, I got a feeling they were delivering merchandise to the hospital. That, that, that's the only thing I can think of. And unfortunately, the merchandise is going to have to wait for another day. I have my very own truck. Wow, out of all the vehicles we were collecting today, a truck didn't even cross my mind. In fact, I kind of want to see what's in the back of this truck. Is it merchandise? It's got to be merchandise, right? All right, one second. I'm going to find somewhere quiet to park up, and we're going to take a little look in the back. <laughs> I got to see what's in there. I mean, it could literally be anything. Here we go, a gas station. Oh, uh, no, there's no way I'm getting this there. I'm going to blow the entire thing up. All right, we're just going to pull over on the curb instead. The moment of truth. Please be good. Please be good. Please be... <gasps> Hello? What? What's in the back? Hold up. This is a desk with like, what, 10 monitors? I'm pretty sure there's more than 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. What? There's 16 monitors. It's a gaming truck. No way. So you can jump on this, play some games. That is so cool. That's amazing. Wow. All right, close that back up. Come on, close it up, dude. I got to get this thing back home. Oh, man. Going back up is way slower than going back down. Why wouldn't this go up quicker? Come on, get up. Screw this. I'm going to drive this thing back home. Out of all the things I expected to find, that was not it. But at least now, if I want to play some video games and drive, I can do it. We can do both. I just hope it's got good Wi-Fi. Now, can we get this into my driveway? I reckon we can. It's only a truck. Oh, my days. As I was saying, the truck is now on my security box. Oh, no, wait, hold on. Yeah, there's no way we're getting this in the drive. This is going to have to stay outside the house, but that's cool. We can still do that, right? We'll get out, get out of the driveway. Get on your wheels. I, I have so broken all those computers inside. ta -da! Yeah, that's so cool. Anyway, let's go to the next one. Ooh, fancy. This one's on a vineyard. Don't mind if I do. Well, let's take a look at what you got for me. Speaking of which, the car park is totally empty. Reckon I'll get some gifts for coming on site. Is there like a fountain we can use? I want to taste the grapes. You know, I want to see what you're growing here. This is <laughs> this is a pretty nice resort. But where's my vehicle? What, what are we going to find? Let me see if I can get like a view over the back garden, I suppose. Oh, okay, we got a lot of people here. Has anyone seen a vehicle that looks like it's probably mine? All right, you don't have to respond. That's fine. You can be rude if you want to. I don't care. I'll just go and find it myself. There's not really many places it could be. It wouldn't be in those, surely. I mean, literally hedge rows. It's got to be on the road, right? I'm pretty sure at this rate we're going to find a tractor or something. Limited options right here. Wait, this, this just goes back up to the top. What the? Hey, come on. Where's my right? Do I have to check down there as well? Are you kidding me, dude? There's so much to explore. I should have taken a vehicle for this. I have checked every road here and there is nothing. So it's gotta be 
within the vines, which means it's quite a small vehicle. Let's go and check out up here. Everything looks the same. Where is it? <sighs> Man, I'm never going to find it at this rate. Come on. All right, check the middle of this one then. It would be great if someone would talk to me about this and tell me where the vehicle might be. Can I climb on this thing? I can't even climb on the head. This is so disappointing. But on the bright side, at least they're growing plenty of grapes. They look amazing. It would be a shame if someone were to shoot them. Okay, they're invincible. I don't know what they've done to them, but suddenly I am not too interested in drinking what they have. <laughs> invincible grapes? That seems a bit sus to me. Oh, wait, hold on, guys. I found it. I think I found it. Hidden amongst the vines of the vineyard is my own 4x4 ATV quad bike thing. Love the lights. Love the design. This is kind of similar to the one which had uh, ASAP on the number plate. I love the design though. This is a Yamaha Banshee 350 from 1987. It's an off-road and they're using this to pick grapes with. Can't even believe it, dude. This is my ride and you're using it to pick grapes? The least you could have done is delivered me some or something. Although I gotta be honest with you, this is really slow. I, I'm, I'm expecting much higher speeds with this, but it sounds like it's doing maximum effort and we're going at like 40 miles an hour. And the steering is awful. I just went straight off the road. I can't take corners very quickly. I can't drive very quickly. The only thing I guess this is good at is driving where you're not meant to go. Like up hills, through bushes, over walls and fences. I guess it's got that going for it, but it's not my favorite. And I had to search an entire vineyard for it. But on the plus side, at least I get to actually store this on my driveway. <laughs> Unlike that truck out front. This is the ninth ride. Can you believe it? We got nine vehicles already. And there's still more to find. I'm actually amazed. How are there still more vehicles to find? And how does Trevor have one of them? That's a helicopter. And it's all mine. Is this the luxury helicopter? You know, the ones with the TVs in the back and the leather seats and whatnot. I love the design. Love the colors. Very on brand. Very me. This is amazing. Let's jump inside and see what it's all about. So I'm pretty sure there's a couple of these helicopters in the world. They don't all look like this, but some are luxury and some aren't. This is the Buckingham Swift. Let's get that side door open. Ah. Oh. Ah, oh, man, it's not a luxury one. One of them is luxury, one of them isn't. I guess I can dream. Uh, we can still dream, but that's fine. I still got a really nice helicopter. It's got my logo, the channel colors. The only downside is it's not luxury, and it doesn't have any rockets, so I can't fire at things with this. With the purple, the blue, and the pink, it stands out like nothing else. I gotta be honest, there's a few places I want to land this, and I think I want to land this not on my helipad or in the driveway, but on my luxury yacht. I gotta drive it on the yacht. <laughs> I mean, this is being parked out back for the entire video. I haven't even done anything with it. So you are going on the yacht. You're completing the experience. Ah, oh, now this is, this is done. This is awesome. <laughs> what a view we're gonna have. Now, I would go inside, but uh, it's pretty dark. I don't think there's electricity on this. We'll just look at this from the house. Ah, oh, just magnificent. My yacht and my helicopter. Believe it or not, there's still more vehicles to find. One of them is supposed to be a Lamborghini. And according to Lenny, whoever's living here is selling everything, including the car which belongs to me. Hold up, no way. Have I just jinxed this? I gotta get a closer look at that thing. I need to see if that's definitely what I think. There's two people around it. What are they doing? Hold on a second. Are they kicking my car? Hey, get away from my car. What are you doing? Hey, no one leaves here. No witnesses. I need to take a look at this. Lamborghini. Oh, no. Are you serious? You've already done some damage. My logo is painted over. Are you kidding me? And great, guys. I'm pretty sure. What does this man say? Does it say no N O U G H? I mean, it's a long shot. I'm pretty sure that was meant to say naught, though. Are you out of your mind? Come on. Looks like I got here five minutes too late. It's a Lamborghini SVJ sunroof convertible. It's one of the modern designs. It's a really cool car. It's expensive, and this might even be faster than the Bugatti Bolida we found before. And it's mine. <laughs> it's got all of the features you would expect to find in a Lamborghini. I just got to get this on solid road so I can test out the top speed once and for all. Now we're picking up some speed. That engine is roaring. <laughs> and the control in this car is actually perfect. Uh, okay, give or take. Give or, maybe that's my driving that isn't so perfect. But it's a good car. Is this one of my favorites? Maybe. If it still had the logos intact, it definitely would be. But we are easily pushing 200 miles an hour in this, which puts it pretty high up the list. Anyway, you know the drill. Lamborghini's got to go outside the driveway. This is an insane car. 
collection. Like, how much money? Do you reckon all of this is worth? Because I reckon this is an easy 50 million dollars right here. Easy. And I'm not even done. Grove Street. I've been saving this one till last. It's the one place I didn't want to go. Because my car is at the bottom of the street. And I can tell they're not going to want me to take it. I ain't got a choice because that right there looks like an expensive piece of kit. What is it? Are you ready to find out? <laughs> it could be a Tesla. It could be Mercedes. Oh, my days. Hold on just a second. Guys, it's got a Dubai number plate and a Rolls Royce logo. This has come far. It's a Rolls Royce race. I'm pretty sure some of these come with starlight ceilings with actual gemstones. Okay, well, here's the deal. I'm going to jump in and drive away. These guys ain't going to stop. Oh, boy. They don't like that plan, though. We better get inside. The door opens backwards. That's so crazy. Hey, fellas. Sorry. I just want to take my car. Oh, on the bright side, at least the acceleration is accepted. <laughs> we took off like an actual rocket. No way. Let me check out the inside. It's got the starlight roof, as I mentioned. Luxury leather seats. But check this out. I do one little acceleration. Oh, yeah. We're already gaining speed. And you know what? This is the speed which feels like if I were to drive into anything, we would be okay. We wouldn't even have a scratch. Whatever we drive into, it's going to be absolutely annihilated. It genuinely feels like a block of lead is driving on wheels. <laughs> and how have I already got it so dusty? Oh, man. I've even dusted up the windscreen. Come on. We're going to have to put this through a car wash or something. I can barely even see the logos on the front. But you'll be pleased to know this is the last vehicle in my collection. That's every single one of them found. Now, the question is, which one is my favorite? And which one is your favorite? Because we got to pick one right now. I really want to say the Rolls Royce. I just love driving that vehicle. I could drive that all day. The Rocket is pretty awesome. I love the Rocket. I would say my latest North car, the six-wheeler, but we found that the other day. I kind of knew it was here. I knew it existed. The plane was awesome. The yacht was awesome. I'm going to go with the... Man, let's go with the rocket car. It's a fun ride. <laughs> the Firebird number one. Which one was yours? Let me know in the comments. Smash like if you enjoyed. And help us get to 7 million subscribers. But this is my incredible collection of vehicles. And I can't wait to find out what's next in my adventure. I will see you guys soon.